Hi guys, my name is Jerome. Welcome to my channel. At the moment, writing software and learning more technologies about it is my priority. Okay, and I think making videos like this just adds more fun and excitement on the process. And today I'm just going to give you an update about my current project in web development. It is a school website. I call it EdWeb1. It has a rich content management system built from scratch from front end to the back end. All right, so uh, yeah, guys, uh, I hope you're having a nice day. So this is where we left off the slider carousel settings last time in my previous video. So the first thing that I'm going to talk about is we have an error during the time and I already fixed it. All right. So I'm just going to show you that when I select another image, uh, then update, there you go, it works. And uh, the error is triggered when I choose a file and then I'll do it again. And then I click update. There was an error. Okay. When I do that, like when I choose a file twice. All right. So right now we, we got it. Uh, uh, mitigated debugged all right and the next thing that I'm gonna be talking about are the new features that I have added on this uh, content management system which is the side information allows you to ch uh, allows you to being able to change the site name right now it says space Academy it's right over here let's refresh the page yeah it says space Academy when you go ahead and change that for example uh, ABC um, school all right and update it okay so I successfully updated view the website see it's ABC school all right so yeah so let's uh, go ahead what are this sidebar key link key link one two three and four those are the things right over here on the side okay so uh, what's those are the links when we go to the site we normally see some other relevant links or that are connected to the site uh, when we click on it for example it uh, routes the user to that particular site okay so we were able to change that using this feature okay so the first one for example uh, about we go to the DepEd website okay so we need to go to the DepEd website deped.gov Okay, we need to go to the DepEd website, copy the link, and paste it right over here. Okay, and how about a YouTube channel? For demonstration purposes, I'll just go ahead and copy the link of my channel. Okay, and paste it right over here. Let's say our YouTube channel. Okay, so I think that's enough. Uh, for this too this one right here also works you can put there a lot of okay just to show you that it's working so let's let's go ahead and click update let's go ahead and view the website okay here's our debit website label and this is our youtube channel and uh, uh, <laughs> uh, letter x that we type a couple of times when we click it it routes the user the debit uh, website we click the youtube channel it routes you to the link that you have specified on the settings okay as you can see uh, the settings here is this one is the label I mean this one right here that's the school name I'm sorry so this is the label of this uh, and this is the link the link it doesn't show up here on the website what shows up uh, what what is being displayed here is just the label okay the link is when you click it routes you to the, to the website okay all right so anyway um, the next one oh right over here on the side uh, you will be able to change the banner the school logo and the logo on the side which is possibly your partner school or sister school okay so let's change the banner gonna choose a banner how about this one for demonstration purposes update 
view the website see we are able to change the banner I'm gonna put it back to the previous banner update view website and we are able to change it let's change the logo as well as the logo right here on the side so on the logo on the left side which is the school logo how about we put it here this orange logo update it okay view the website we are able to change the logo okay refresh it and then uh, on the partner logo let's choose a file let's change it into this one update it okay affiliate logo update successful view website and we are able to change the logo all right so that's a neat feature for our content management system we have the footer links so you can see the footer links uh, is right over here okay these are the labels we will change that okay um you, if, if you will notice i also changed a bit the theme of the front end it's right now it's uh orange theme because the old website uh let me just show you i mean the original design is uh, green or lime green okay so this is the original design i mean my initial design okay let's close this one and uh, yeah and this is our new uh, theme okay orange and gray and uh, let me just put it aside so you can see there's already a difference okay all right so we're going to um, change the things on the footer let me just log in I just uh, I accidentally closed the site settings site settings all right so here is the column right now it says ABC column title ASD FZZ so how about for example uh, relevant links okay and column one how about um, maybe office of the president okay we see this on government website okay about here office of the vice president just for demonstration purposes but right now i'll just go ahead and route it to google.com okay so i'll paste here at google.com and the other one how about microsoft.com just for demonstration purposes that it is working okay i'll copy the link okay uh let's make it relevant let's say google google website and this one microsoft for the label okay so i'll go ahead. i'm not going to be changing it's the same concept on the other links i'm going to go ahead and click update view the website as you can see it now it now says relevant links on the label google website and uh, microsoft website when we click it it brings us to microsoft when we click the google website it brings us to the Google all right cool right so uh, let's go back to the settings I'm trying to make this video at least less than 10 minutes so on the partners column 2 it works the same way on right here should I okay for example um, uh, Jerome Morales website it's my link is already here okay right now it says web.gov.ph1 I'm going to click on update and view the website now it says Jerome Morales website over here when I click on it it uh, routes you to my page okay so how about this uh, YouTube video all right we will be able to update that as well as uh, and also the promo I call it promo one promo two <laughs> okay I think that's necessary for the website probably this one could be the infomercial or anything that is uh, an advertisement uh, for the school Okay, so right now if we click that, it shows it it, it, it displays the a video on the enrollment system that I created a few months ago. Okay, so I'll pause that and let's say I'm gonna 
I was already disabled video. because this is the last. All right, so I'll go uh, click on share, embed, and I'll copy the link right over here. Okay, copy, control C. I'll go back to the settings and I paste the link over here. Then I change the label to new video. I'll click on update, view the website. See, we are able to update the video. Okay, as you can see, you can see the thumbnail there. And it's responsive. If we're going to uh, view it on iPhone, it looks like that. See, we play it. Th this button right here will, will show up. Okay, it will be enabled. Okay, right, so uh, it's working. There's a program. There's dirt, dirt. You just pause it. Go back to the normal view. How about this one? This image right here can be found on the on this part right here. Uh, promo one. And the link. Let's let's get a link maybe right on on the site internal links. Okay, let's put it right here. And then let's update the image into how about this book? Update. Okay, view the website. Let's go back to the bottom promo one the label has been changed the picture has been changed when we click it it should route you to this page okay the link that we have created all right so i think that that's it and uh, if you will notice we i also have changed the layout on the side um, instead of uh, this is the old design i mean the previous design i, I have you the list of categories and the archive Instead of doing that, we uh, have created here, I, I, I put it here, our platforms and the most commonly used platforms today in online learning. Or it can be anything, all right? We also have a settings for that one. Uh, same way that we are able to change the stops on the footer, as well as being able to change on the logo and the header of the website. Okay, and I hope you guys uh, like it all right so uh, the next uh, uh, hopefully um, the next uh, video is to show you the 100 percent completion of the site so right now probably it's about 90 percent okay thank you guys for watching until next time like subscribe and share this video and for all of you guys who support my channel I'd highly appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. Peace and keep safe.